Today marks the final home game for one of the greatest players in K-State history. Last week against Missouri, he became only the second player to eclipse the 2,000 point mark. And with his 17 points today, he now has 2,054 for his career. In recognition of this remarkable achievement and an All-American career, head coach Frank Martin is presenting a game ball commemorating the passing of the 2,000 point milestone to Jacob Pollan! And now, ladies and gentlemen, Please welcome K-State basketball coach, Frank Martin. I'm gonna be real brief. Uh, number one, before I, I, I turn this over to who this is all for, I gotta say thank you to every single one of you in this building, because you are absolutely, by far, the best fans in the country, and it's an honor to play for you guys. You know, back in early January, when we weren't playing real well, and we were going through our lumps and bruises, there was one guy that stood up and publicly challenged everybody, including me, to do a better job back in early January. Let it be known that losing is unacceptable. Losing at home can never happen. And, and up the standards of the work ethic that we all had to do to become a better team. I couldn't be prouder for this moment, handing this basketball over. Uh, we still got a lot of games to be played now. He's got a lot of points to score. And before I introduce them, I, I got to tell you one thing as fans, because I don't get to see sometimes when you talk to the media, they only tell you the part that they want you to know. They don't give you the whole story. So I got a chance to tell you the whole story. When I got hired as the head basketball coach four years ago, he was the first guy that said, I'm sticking with you guys. I ain't changing my commitment. And I'm real thankful for Mr. and Mrs. Pullen for being in that corner when that decision was made. K-State's own, I'm so happy he changed his hairdo, Jacob Pullen. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Jacob Pollard! I just want to, um, I want to say thank you to everybody in the crowd for your support for four years. It was an amazing experience for me, it's something I wouldn't trade for the world. I want to thank my coaching staff, my teammates, all my teammates, you know. And to be honest, it's something that if somebody would have told me I would have came here four years ago and all of this would have happened, I wouldn't have believed them. But you guys, through the ups and the downs, made this thing possible. And the only thing I can, I can do to help you guys out is try to win three in three days in Kansas City. <laughs> 